that you're getting power station travel bundle feature price today at $499.99 $100 off six flex payments of $83.33 free shipping and handling as well I'm really just going to get right to it because I really want to introduce you to Justin Smith who is joining me to explain what this is going to mean when your power goes out mm -hmm. you're going to grab for this and it is going to work to to do so many things because most of us I don't have a generator, yeah. okay? I don't want a generator, right. but I want power when I need it, and this is gonna give it to me, and it's so, it's the size of a toaster. Yeah, gallon of, uh, like a gallon of milk, it's only yeah. 11 pounds. I'm glad you did that, Alice, because that's what I was gonna ask you to do, is pick mm -hmm. that up and show everybody that it's, it's you so know, small. it doesn't take a big burly man to lift that up like those big gas power generators you do, and it's great, you live in a condo, right? So yeah. it's great if you live in a condo or a townhome or an apartment or something like that, you can't keep those big gas generators that give off those toxic fumes mm -hmm. inside, but guess what? You can keep the EcoFlow River inside because this is a 21st century battery powered generator, meaning that it will give you an industrial amount of power, 100,000 milliamps, that's 50 times more powerful than those little power banks right here that only charge your phones once or twice. These are great if you run out of power for about an hour, but what happens if that natural disaster comes through or you wanna go off the grid, hunting, camping, fishing, tailgating for more than an hour or a day or two or three or maybe a week at a time? you're gonna need something that is going to give you the equivalent amount of power that a gas power generator does. You know, it wasn't long ago that we would drive down the road and we would see electric cars and we would say, oh, there's no way those things are gonna last. They're not more powerful or efficient than my gas guzzler. Well, guess what? The 21st century is here and this is future proof because now you can't drive a mile down the road without seeing a battery powered car mm -hmm. or four or five of them everywhere. Same thing with the EcoFlow, let's get right to it. When you lose that power, all you're gonna do is take it off the shelf or wherever you have this stored out of the box. It is plug and play, there is no fancy setup. You're gonna take it out and one button press, you can do this at home. Again, it's only 11 pounds, watch right here. One button press and immediate access to that 100,000 milliamps, and then if I've lost lights or I've lost power, I'll get to these right here in the front in a second, but I wanna get to where the EcoFlow River is worth its weight in gold. Look on the back here. These are those three-pronged AC, alternating current wall outlets that you can plug virtually any device, any appliance around your house into the back of the EcoFlow and get your life back to normal. So what I did is I brought a uh, just a traditional table lamp here. We're gonna go ahead and turn this on. So we have our light going. There you see immediate access. It wasn't like it took a trickle charge or it's not flickering or anything. And I, now I've got a fan, my industrial powered fan. Fan just came on, but if I was up north, this could be a heater during a winter storm. And I got my lights and my fans going, and now I can keep going to stay in contact with my friends and my family. We need to make a phone call or get on the internet. We've got nine ways to plug in and charge things, and you see, Unlike some other battery power generators, I'm not unplugging one thing to power or plug in another. I can charge nine things at the same time for over, get this, a hundred hours. That is four days that I can keep the lights, the fans, my, uh, let's see, Lori just had this on a second ago. This is our little uh, Wi-Fi hotspot so that I can have internet. We even give you that old school cigarette lighter here on the back. We see that just came on. You see the power to that is now on. Now I've got my phones, Jeez. my tablets, everything going and I can keep going, keep charging for over a hundred hours with my lights and my fans and everything. I told you it was the superpower. Yeah. That is a superpower, but it is super small and super smart. Let me tell you need this you are gonna love having this I you will use this I mean let's face it at some point your power is gonna go out mm -hmm. and it can go out for days we lost power last time we had a hurricane here some people were my parents were without power for like over a week yep so you're gonna have the ability now to get the information you need because your phone is gonna be charged you can keep cool because you have a fan because you have a light you're not sitting there in the dark you know with a little tiny flashlight or anything but here's the thing we're doing okay not only did we take a hundred dollars off of this which is a pretty awesome some savings because look at the retail value is $185 more but what we're doing is if you want to finance this on your HSN card 
then you can split this up into 12 payments. It works out to be $41.66 a month. And that is crazy. And I'm going to tell you why. Because $41.66, as long as this is paid for in full within 12 months, then you will pay absolutely zero interest. And you're still able to use your coupon where you save $20. So as soon as you buy this with your HSN card, you're gonna get an additional $20 off and then the ability to split it up into 12 payments. It is so small, it really is. It is the size of a toaster. You can take this absolutely anywhere, whether you're a camper, whether you uh, just wanna use it for your emer in case of emergency. This is even great on boats. I mean, it's, it's yeah. super anywhere, but something that you will use over and over again, and free shipping today as well. I love this. I, I see a big screen TV out here. Yep. Can this really power a TV? Yeah, here, since you mentioned it, let me just, uh, since I'm tethered to this light here, let's just go on over there, and uh, I'll show you that real quick before I get to my next thing. Because, you know what, uh, It's this is very exciting that it can actually power a TV. You know, there's others you know, power mm -hmm. banks, industrial chargers out there that are lead acid. There's some that, you know, you might have seen recently that they're a lead acid battery. The EcoFlow is great because it is lithium ion. It's a safe system. And that's the reason it only weighs 11 pounds. Those lead acid batteries, it's basically a car battery. They're not safe and they, they weigh about 40 pounds and those will not charge and power your TV. But guess what? The EcoFlow again, one button press right here. Let me show you one button press industrial amount of power, and you see here on the screen, that represents how many hours of power you have left, how much charge you have left, and the input and output wattage that the uh, whatever device you have plugged in is drawing at any given time. So this is your screen, so you never have any interruption in power. You know exactly when to recharge your river so you don't run out of those lights or fans or whatever you have plugged in. But let's go ahead and plug in our TV in the back. Let me go ahead and turn it on with my remote here. Isn't that crazy? That's a 32 that up, inch right? TV. It's a 32 inch mm -hmm. high definition 1080p TV that this EcoFlow River, you see it just came on right there. And so you see, I'm not fibbing to you here if you can, no, there's no smoke and mirrors. I'm just gonna pick this up and <laughs> I could literally, you see my TV stays on. I am not tethered to a thing and I can walk away and I can take my TV. Great, think about tailgating just started. All you guys oh, who like to go tailgating. For tailgaters, this is a, yeah. just a Perfect gift. And think about the natural disaster situation. You need to keep yourself entertained. You need to watch the storm. You need to keep the kids entertained. Watch yeah. your Netflix, watch your cable, whatever you want. You're going to want this to keep your TV plugged in. And I actually have uh, tested this on my 65 inch LG OLED TV at home. And it'll charge that for basically a full day. But this smaller one, it can do it for many days at a time, wow. keeping you during those natural disasters. But just so you, you can see the immense amount of power, I'll keep the TV plugged in. But I also brought along a power drill, <laughs> right? Just in the name in and of itself, a power drill here, um, it draws an immense amount of power. And you can see there, you can take it camping and she's doing string lights and she's carrying it with her. You know, she's plugging it into a projector. This will charge a projector for over 10 hours. So let's say you have a campfire, a bonfire, you wanna go out in the middle of the forest, you can take that with you and charge backyard a- Backyard movie? A backyard movie or, or, you know, electric guitar, it'll charge that for over 10 hours. All right, so I've got my power drill plugged in here and you see my TV is still on. We're not gonna lose any power. Okay, fine. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> not that you would ever need your TV and a power drill at the same time, but just to show you that it can do it and I'm not tethered to anything but this industrial amount of power, this, this mega power source right here that does give you the equivalent amount of power that those clunky gas generators do. And I wanna add one thing to, to your point here, Alice, is that those gas generators, think about when the natural disasters move through and all the power goes out in a neighborhood or in an area. When do the looters come out? They come out when there's no power. With a gas generator, you have to keep those outside because of the toxic fumes, but you run the power cords inside to all your devices and you have to keep the doors and windows open to right. run those power cords outside. That's a safety issue. With the EcoFlow River, you keep this inside. Keep it next to your bed. You can even take it in your car with you. So great if you live in an apartment or a condo or anything like that. It's also much safer than those gas or power uh, gas power generators as well. Yeah, it's an investment. There's no question. This is an investment though that you will have year after year after year mm -hmm. after year after year.
and you will use this so many different ways that you don't even know yet. But all of a sudden you'll go, oh, you know what? I want to go outside. I want to watch a movie. Let's have a backyard movie. You can do that. Think about if you're camping, you now can take your electric grill. You can take your Curtis Stone or your Wolfgang mm -hmm. Huck grill and plug it in and use it. You can plug in your coffee pot. You can do so many things. It's an immense amount of power to run a TV and a power drill for hours and hours, not like, oh, okay, I got 20 minutes out of yeah. it. We're talking hours and hours and hours. So small, so compact. We do have a bonus buy with this. So if you purchase our Eco River, then um, we're gonna give you another little bonus as well on on the solar panel. So this is uh, going to help to charge it. And uh, if you order the Eco River, you can get $50 off on your uh, solar uh, panel as well. Uh, we do have colors in this as well. Uh, no, I think we only have the black uh, available own, right okay. now. Okay, yeah, and we only the have the black, and I think we have, how many do we, how many do we have left? We have 400 left of the Eco River. This is one of those smart investments that when it, when the power goes out, and you can do whatever you want. You can plug things in. You, you know, when the power goes out, Justin, mm -hmm. that's when you need your TV to find out what's going on, for heaven's sakes. Absolutely. And it, again, I want to reiterate, this is not those little two or 4,000 milliamp, you know, little yeah, power banks that charge your cell phones once great. or twice. Those, this charges know? TVs. This charges mini fridges. This charges power tools for days on end. But get this, just because you lose power doesn't mean you lose internet. I brought a Wi-Fi router here. This is what brings the internet internet into your home. I'm going to keep my TV plugged in. I'm going to go ahead and plug in my Wi-Fi router here to show you that when you lose power, you can still have the internet. You see my router just came on. You see it just lit up. And now I have the ability to have internet back going. How many of us rely on internet for our smart TVs, our phones, our tablets, our computers? Many of us are working from home nowadays that work out in the field in the office. It's like a 50-50 ratio. And if we have a satellite office in Chicago and they weren't in the Southeast and didn't get the hurricane or out West and they didn't get the fire and they don't have power, your boss may not care that you can't get your work done. You still have to have the ability to have internet to track the storms, to keep the kids or yourself entertained. But also I brought a computer just so you can see I can keep going. I got my MacBook Pro right here and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, plug in my MacBook Pro. Let's so turn that around. What did you say, nine devices you can plug in? Up to nine devices at the same time. And you see, I am not unplugging. Let me untether, the, let me just undo this real quick so I have a little bit more slack with my router there. I am not unplugging one thing to unplug, to plug in another. I can charge nine things at the same time. I'm gonna go ahead and charge up my MacBook Pro here. So now I can do my work. So we got this going. You'll see that probably pop on here in a second. The MacBook Pro just came on. I've got internet with my router. And let me just go through the ports on the front here. There's seven ports on the front. These are USB-C ports. This is future proof because in about a year or two, um, all your MacBook Pros, all of your Lenovo's, your cell phones, they're gonna be utilizing these USB-C ports. So when you're purchasing one of these, think about it, do your research on your power banks because you're gonna want these USB-C ports. Here's your four USB ports. These are your two regular USB ports and these blue ones here, those are gonna be your fast time ports. So if it used to take you two hours to charge your cell phone, now it's only gonna take you one with these blue ones right here. Seven on the front and then if I turn it around again so you can see two on the back, these are your alternating current ports right here. The same ones that you have around your wall, virtually anything you can plug in around your house at your home, you can plug into the back of the EcoFlow River. But you know what? I'm glad you said nine because follow me over here. I'm gonna go ahead and unplug all this here. You see the TV's still running and it will run for days on end, but let me go ahead and take that off. Let's go over here and I wanna show you a way that you can plug in more than nine things and more than just two devices on the back. Now this is gonna blow your mind. You might have said earlier, okay, Justin, I saw it do one light, one fan, a TV, great. But I need more lights, I need more fans. I need, I just need to get things back to normal after yeah. that um, that natural disaster, which by the way, just last Thursday, the National Weather Service, they upped their, they boosted their prediction from 10 storms to 17 yeah, named storms with four to six of them mm. being major landfalling. And all it takes is one natural disaster. I mean, ask the folks in, uh, you know, in the panhandle of Florida last year, if it was a busy Gosh. hurricane season. All it takes is the one natural disaster. But let's go ahead. I'm gonna plug in my light again. You're gonna see that going. But how about this? Hold on, stay there, stay there. Where did I put it? Here we go. Look at, I left it's, it over it's here for you. It's the size of a toaster. So. It's, so, it's so small. I cannot get over that. In fact, I asked you, I said, I 